<laughs> free babysitting and free vasectomies. <laughs> The crack of the whip makes the audience want to scream again. But this time, scream just like someone got hurt. Some of you are applauding. Some of you are just waiting to see when my arms are going to explode. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. My name is Adam Crack, your friendly neighborhood whip cracker. Welcome to the Fire Whip Show. I've got a lot of great stuff planned for all of you this morning. We're going to have some two-fisted whips of fury right back here. We've got a chainmail bull whip right down there. And in that can, soaking in the fuel, is a fire whip. And when we take it out, it's going to make a fireball. Right. Now I'd like to continue with the two fisted whips of fury right here. <laughs> hey, plenty more where that came from. records for whip cracking. That is true. But what I really want to be is a world champion. And this year the world championships are being held in Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm, I'm going to go and I want to win. So what I'm going to give those judges is a super secret slice of sweet whip cracking magic that should knock their socks off. Here's how it's going to go down. We'll start one whip in front and then I will ever so carefully time the other whip to shoot right through it, just like this. to use a whip to destroy something! Yeah! Hey kid, come here. No, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to whip a kid, no, no. What I'm going to whip are these, which are fun for the kids. Water balloons. Oh crap. Water balloons from mid-air. Now, I can pop these right next to you. Who wants the first one? Who wants them? Okay. Wait, don't. Okay. Now are you, what's your name? Richard? No. Okay, Richard, are you sure you don't want to sit down over there where it's safer? You want to be right there? Okay, how do you want this water balloon there, Richard? You want it um, over easy, sunny side up, right on your forehead? <laughs> you want another one, Richard? <laughs> Hit him with it. Okay, let's mix it up, Richard. Here you go. Just swing the thing. Okay, that's good enough. Here. And he got it! <laughs> All right. Okay, now we have one left. I got one water balloon left. It can go to anyone out here. Anyone out here. Just have to let me know who wants it. If you want it, you gotta make a Don't worry, kid, it's the desert. You'll dry out really quick. 
Now, I'm aware when I go to the World Championships that if I'm throwing water balloons at my adoring fans, it may not look that good. So, what I'm going to give them at the World Championships is this. The battle of metal against metal. A metal whip versus a metal can. Here, in the red, white, and blue label, a can of Diet Pepsi. And in steel and gunmetal gray, a chainmail bull whip. The only bull whip of the Renaissance Fair that can double as a part of Mr. T's wardrobe. <laughs> now, this contest could go either way. If the can strikes true, it will be split in half. Spraying soda everywhere. <laughs> However, if the chainmail bull whip strikes false, it could be broken against the corporate conglomerate that is PepsiCo. So, who is cheering for the can? Okay. Who's cheering for the Chainmail Bullwhip? Yeah! Chainmail Bullwhip, the clear crowd favorite today. Now, if the Chainmail Bullwhip does win, this will be over in an instant. So, focus on the can. Do not watch me. Do not watch the whip. Watch the can, people. <laughs> Focus on the can. This is going down on three. Or until that guy resets his camera. On three. time, the chain mail bullwhip is victorious. And I do have a Guinness World Record for cutting cans in half. 23 cans in three minutes. But I am more than just a young whippersnapper. I have other interests as well. I enjoy swing dancing, Swedish language films, and playing blues harmonica. So as the swoops, as the Swedes say, tank for outstone it, melon bargain, or pop for and do stick it out. <laughs> 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 